Well, welcome. My name is Fred Bell. I am the Managing Director of the Palm Springs Air Museum, and I would like to welcome all of you to the unveiling of our Super Saber. This is a unique day in that this particular aircraft, every aircraft that we restore is a challenge. Every acquisition that we have is a, is a challenge, but this particular airplane has about a three-year history of acquisition and getting it here. It is unique in that it is the only complete F-100D model anywhere in the world that is airworthy. This airplane is complete. So what I'd like to do now is recognize the Cathedral City High School ROTC here. They're going to present colors. And if you'll all rise for the presentation of colors. Uh, where it continued 
in that uh, vein training uh, F-100 pilots. And then it moved overseas to the Torreon, Spain, and went back with the 401st, which had moved from uh, Louisiana to Torreon. And finally, in 1969, it went to Turkey. And it was part of the Turkish Air Force. Uh, and we don't know much, I don't know much about what went on over there, of course. Uh, but I'm assuming they flew kind of like we did and then had flew missions uh, to train their pilots. And uh, it was there for 20 years, about to go to the beer can factory, and was saved by a company uh, in Mojave that wanted some, some F 100s. Uh, it ended up at Stead Air Force Base, uh, parked on the ramp 2004. Uh, as last flight was in 2004. But that's the story about this airplane. Uh, we love it. I love it. We all love it. So, yeah, thank you for coming, and uh, that's the story about this airplane. Yes, hi, I'm Karen Miles, and I know through me, Ken would love to, uh, to say how much he appreciates all of you being here, and how much he appreciates Fred Bell, the uh, Air Museum, all of the incredible volunteers. But I know that he's, he's here right now, this, this right now, and uh, he, he wants me uh, to thank all of you and how appreciative he is of this moment. Very, very wonderful time. And uh, we absolutely love the Hun. Hi, I'm Bob Lilac, and I'm for the uh, F-100 drivers that are here and anybody was here last night, I'm not gonna repeat my act. But having said that, I just want to uh, tell the folks that are here that weren't here last night that we, you have here amongst you a bunch of guys who are in this name tag and these are guys that flew the F-100. So we've got close to 50 of them plus their guests here. So all of you folks, please wander around and visit with them. I will invite our guests to go to the front of the airplane. We're gonna unveil the aircraft. So Karen, Al, come on around, Bob, come on, help them. And why don't you guys pull forward The airplane is unveiled. Now what we're going to do for all of you Sabre drivers, you Hun drivers, you can sign either side of the aircraft, whichever you feel comfortable with. One side is Al's. If you flew with Ken, sign Ken's side. But one thing we do here is we're going to do a toast. And if Greg, Greg is going to, first of all, as I said, this airplane is operational, so Greg, Vanna here is going to, there you go, thank you. Open the aircraft up. She is an operational bird. And as I said, you can't go to the Air Force Museum and do that. None of their airplanes will do that. What I want to do now is do a toast. We're going to get the champagne out. Where is Al? There you go, take the drink. Oh, look at all Cheers. We have champagne for all of you. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the, the uh, aircraft is now accepted in the Palm Springs Air Museum inventory as one of our airplanes. It will be going in the Miles hangar. You notice I said will be, not maybe. It is going to happen. It is will be. It will be, it will as Karen be. says. What I'd like to do now is invite you, the, the Hun drivers, to come up, sign the aircraft, 